recent years, organized retail crime has uh, really increased in especially the western suburbs in the area that I represent. Um, crime networks have really been utilizing the chaotic smash and grab uh, tactics in stores across uh, the country with numerous events occurring in Chicago as well as in the western suburbs. Uh, retail theft is not a victimless crime. What happens is people come in to smash and grab. They scare the employees. They scare the, um, the, the folks who are there patronizing the stores. And they do damage as well. So to make a collaborative effort um, in controlling the, the frequency, the magnitude, and the severity of these organized crimes, this proposal will address the systemic issues that are raised by law enforcement, prosecutors, and retail advocacy groups to bring offenders to justice. So House Bill 1091 codifies a legal definition for organized retail crime and provides the prosecution with additional resources to charge perpetrators. As or organized retail crime becomes more prevalent across the country, Illinois is going to be um, updating its laws to fight back against this. I believe House Bill 1091 is the appropriate response to reiterate consequences to the individuals who threaten local economic growth and participate in organized retail crimes. Mm -hmm.